What is going on guys, Tactical Bacon here, and thank you very much for checking out today's video, which is going to be some Daisy Vanilla Mod Season 3, Episode 6. So if you don't remember in the last episode, Episode 5, you can actually go back and watch that right now. Uh, towards the end of the mission, or towards the end of the video rather, I was at a mission and came across some guy and killed him with a gun that I normally don't kill people with. So that was actually kind of cool and took a lot of his gear, mostly the... Uh, Mark 48 mod with a hollow sight on it you see me carrying there. And basically I'm working my way up to another mission right now. That's pretty much all the setup you need for this part of the video. But if you look at the video overlay very quickly, you will see a short link to a uh, Steam group that I created, Full Metal Misfits. It is part of the Misfit Media kind of stuff that we're just gonna be doing like Arma 2 DayZ stuff. There's gonna be a link in the description of this video. If you guys would like to go over there and join it, this is pretty much for the like subscriber series stuff essentially if you guys want to go over there and join that be my guest there's going to be some more details over there about when we're going to be starting the subscriber series it's actually going to be starting in a week from now but you guys will be able to figure out all that kind of information there if you are interested in doing so but like i said that's pretty much all the setup you guys need for today's video remember if you like it to leave it a thumbs up and comment down below also go join our facebook group at yt tactical bacon also, follow me on Twitter at YT Tactical Bacon. And without any further ado, let's go ahead and jump into today's video. God damn, there's a million zombies down here. I'm gonna go for that orange brick house first. Try taking out some of these zombies along the way, I suppose. God, I really hope there's not another player here. Because I would be able to just go straight over to that fucking mission that's about two clicks away. But unfortunately, my character is dying of thirst. I know there's a well over here though, so not a big deal. Just come over here and get hydrated. Hopefully without being smashed to death by zombies. I already have those. Come on, give me some food. Can't remember if there's a corner store over here or not. Fuck, that is not a good way to go. Open door. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Oh my god, I can't get in that house that way. Okay, I will just come in this way, and all is well. Oh man, that can of unknown is uh, mighty tempting right now. Let's see, nothing, nothing, and oh, there's never anything up there. Actually, I should. Mm, I was gonna say I should go this way, but. No. Yep, I'm fucked. No, I still have bandages. Oh wow. All right, maybe I need to come over here first. No, I need to kill this zombie first. Cause it's gonna take me forever to bandage, isn't it? Luckily, I don't think any of them can get in through this door. I think they can only get in through that one, unless they. Open the little door to the fence over there, which I don't think they're really inclined to do right now. God damn it. These fucking fences are always in the way. Okay, there's a way in over here. If I can get some more food, and definitely get some water because my drink meter is flashing like a motherfucker right now. Alright, there's some food. Fuck, I'm really gonna need to drink something soon. Uh, compass? Do I have a compass? Yes, I do. I already have a compass. Hey, there's a can of razor, which is like. Russian Surge, I guess. <laughs> so that'll do just fine for right now. Actually, this was a good idea to stop here. 
Don't want the empty tin can. What do we got here? Another drink. Uh, that is a Pepsi. I don't need that anymore. Okay. Now let me come over here on this thing and stuff my face real quick. Try to get that blood level back up because it is uncomfortably low right now. I don't think this food's going to make too much of a difference. But might as well fill up before I go. Alright, that zombie knows exactly where I'm at. Oh, fuck. And there went more of my blood. Very nice. These assholes have like little encampment built over here. This whole thing could actually end up hurting me more than it's going to help me. Nothing over there. I don't know if shit spawns on the steps of those things in the vanilla mod. I know that at one point in time they used to do so on, uh, on standalone before you could go inside of them. Chips. I mean that's suppose that I could just keep eating stuff until my blood goes up, but that would be kind of pointless, right? Oh shit. Holy grail. Just keep drinking. Alright, and also we need to fill this water bottle. There's nothing in here, right? Oh, wait. I thought I already came into this one. I guess that was a different one. Alright, we got a can of pork. This doesn't get my blood going. I don't know what will. And might as well eat these chips. I mean, that's pretty much all we can really do. Holy shit, I'm not used to that sound and it fucking scared the shit out of me at first. But yeah, I guess that's really all I can do for right now. I mean... Full on, uh... Full on food and... Full on drink. Doubt that I'm really gonna find that much more in that town, so... That was, uh, it wasn't Vibor, that was, uh, oh shit, that was Vibor, okay. Well, I need to go over to Lapatino, because that's where that mission is. And I know it's a weapons truck mission, but there might be some other stuff there, possibly on the AI. I don't know, like, I've never done a mission to the point of, like, I completely killed all the AI and went in to loot. Holy shit. It's a car over there. That's the first car I've seen in this fucking server. This might be boarded up and... No? Well, it might be a boarded up area and it might be somebody's base, but apparently not. Because apparently there is base building in this server. People have... Decided to board up some buildings and stuff. Very simple form of base building. I wouldn't say it's like epoch level base building, but I mean, it doesn't really need to be. Car looks like it might actually be function. Functionable. Uh. No piles of wood. I actually killed two animals and I'm looking for a pile of wood right... Oh, wait a minute. Wait, can I... Can I cook food on this? <gasps> I be damned. I can cook food on this. That is fucking awesome. I had no idea. 
that you can cook your fucking... Wait. Oh, okay. Yeah, I had no idea that you can cook your food on a pile of burning tires. Cook that. Hopefully nobody sees the smoke. Go ahead and put it out. Eat this bacon. Cause that actually should help on getting my blood up. I, I don't know, I just decided that I needed something to kind of help get that blood level going. I thought, what better than cooked animal flesh? I mean, honestly, with as low as my blood was, fucking, it wouldn't take a very powerful round to put me down for good, you know? Um... I don't know if it's really gonna be worth it, but you can check it out. Come here, zombie. I'm gonna talk to you for a second. Oh, fuck. There we go. Taking over a medical cache? Okay, that's not the one I'm going to. I'm surprised that the one that I'm going to is still up. What is wrong with this car? Wheels are okay. This thing ain't going anywhere. I was about to say, let's see if it drives, but it clearly needs repairs that I am not uh, accurately equipped to perform right now. But. I mean, we got our health back up. I would say that it's a little over a third of the way, so... This is not too terribly bad. I guess I'm gonna have some zombies chasing me. Fuck, 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 fuck. Okay, so hopefully this guy... Doesn't notice me or all the zombies running around with me. Be kind of hard not to, considering that I've got like a gang of them chasing after me right now, but it's cool. I'm sure, I can get a few of them off my tail around here. But yeah, I mean, only 700 some odd meters to go. Fucking Christ. There's a million of them behind me. I mean, I know, like... Jesus, there should only be like two or three behind me still. Okay, oh fuck, I was about to say, alright, it's down to three now. I to lose these zombies before I get too close to this mission. Or maybe I should take them over here with me. Okay, so after I got to that mission and camped around for a little bit, I realized that that gun fires very, very quick. And there was no way to change the fire mode or anything like that, so... I went through 28 rounds pretty quick. I ended up putting down at least two, maybe even three of the AI, but that was definitely not enough to take the mission over, so to speak. Um, so right now I'm up here at Northwest Airfield in hopes of either getting a new primary weapon or maybe some ammo for this old primary weapon. Either one would be just fine with me. But I see that they have a, like, modified tent city-like thing that they have in, uh, standalone, or had in standalone. I'm not exactly sure what the fuck they've done with it. Um, who knows, maybe I'll get lucky and, well, you know, a gauze. But maybe I'll get lucky and find a belt up here or something, I don't know. 
kind of doubt it though. Looks pretty scarce of any kind of materials to be honest with you. Where's that zombie go? Okay. What do we have here? Definitely not the ammo that I'm looking for. It's definitely ammo that I will take. Because who knows, I might come across one of those guns. Somewhere. Mm -hmm. There's an MRE. That's actually really good. Really good find. So if I'm not mistaken, it restores... Uh, both food and drink. At least it does on Overpock now. I highly doubt that those are the kinds that you can get into. Come here, zombies. I need you guys to come to me. be some ammo in this. I don't think that that's the kind that I need, but like I said, it's ammo, so I will take it. Actually, I'm almost positive that it's not the kind that I need. Alright, come here, zombies. No? Still don't want anything to do with me? Even though I'm just walking around and you're general vicinity I guess they don't give a shit now that one I may need to chop up whoa yeah I have 15 minutes to clean wound before blood loss starts uh, that's not good That's really, really not good. Um, is there some kind of wipes or something that I should have? Why am I bleeding again? Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm still bleeding, because I did not wait long enough for that bandage to take. Oh, I'm gonna fucking die soon. I know it. There's no way around it. Because I've got... i got these two pieces of meat that might help out a little bit, but... Once that infection starts kicking in, I am done-zo.